Okay, next guys, from the front sprawl position, you manage to defend that double leg takedown. You're sprawled on top of them or you're already in a front headlock position. Go to the Cobra neck crank. I love this thing. I attack a lot of guys with it. It wastes very little energy and you tap quite a few guys with it. Okay, so from a front turtle position, I a lot of times just rest with, with my hand cupping his chin. That's good neck control, good head control. And then when I can, I'm going to underhook on this far side. From here, I'm going to throw this hand towards his back, towards his back shoulder blade. Step my left foot up, and I want to try and turn in a tight circle, hip to hip, to rotate him over, using this as a leverage, okay, as a thrower, and trying to turn my left hip, try and turn that all the way towards his hip. Spin him, keep his head off the ground, rotate his chin, and bring it up to his head. Okay, just like a Mark Coleman headlock neck crank, but with his chin turned way sideways, then you're compressing, so it's both a neck crank and a choke, you got him hooked this way. But the best thing is, I don't have long arms, it's not like a Darce choke or a Marsh choke, or an anaconda, rolling anaconda choke. It doesn't waste a lot of energy for me to squeeze and try and get it in deep. If I was long like Kendall Grove, that's easy, but if you're short and stubby, like me, this is something very simple to do because you're just, you're not wasting any energy. I'm in here a lot and all I gotta do is I fight a lot to get this chin. If I get a chin grip, here, maybe I'm hitting him. If it was pride rules, maybe, or the street, I'm kneeing him in the head. But I'm gonna underhook here, throw him to the side, get that side mount, pull that chin out, and compress his head up to his chest. I don't like to settle the guy and then bring him back up to waste energy. Get used to going slow with this because it's dangerous, but compress him right away and uh, use the cobra neck crank anytime you get in the front sprawl position. Okay, the position in the front sprawl or uh, front face lock, grab that chin and turn the corner and go right to it.